subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. In Python, bytes like objects are a crucial part of working with binary data. They provide a way to represent and manipulate sequences of bytes efficiently. In this tutorial, we will explore what bytes like objects are, how to create and manipulate them, and where they are commonly used. A bytes like object is an immutable sequence of bytes. It can be thought of as a sequence of integers, each representing a byte of data. Bytes like objects are commonly used for handling binary data such as images, sound files, and network protocols. You can create a bytes like object using the literal representation by prefixing a sequence of bytes with a B or B. For example, the bytes constructor can be used to create a bytes like object from various sources, such as strings, lists, or other iterable objects. Bytes like objects support indexing and slicing, similar to other sequences in Python. You can concatenate bytes like objects using the plus operator. Iterating over bytes is straightforward. You can find the index of a subsequence within bytes. Bytes like objects are immutable, meaning their values cannot be modified once they are created. If you need to modify the data, consider using byte array. Converting bytes to a string can be done using the decode method. Converting bytes to an integer can be useful for various applications. Bytes like objects are commonly used for reading and writing binary files. Bytes are frequently used for sending and receiving data over networks. Bytes are essential in cryptographic operations. Understanding bytes like objects is crucial for working with binary data in Python. Whether you are dealing with file I.O., networking, or cryptography, mastering the manipulation of bytes will empower you to work effectively with binary data in your Python projects. ChatGPT